This video is brought to you by the YouthQuest Foundation. It is part of our 3D ThinkLink initiative to serve America's at-risk youth. Our 3D design software of choice is Moment of Inspiration. And this video is a short overview of the Moment of Inspiration interface. This area of the interface is reserved for the view window. Each view can be individually shown in the entire area, or the area can be split like this, so that all four views can be seen at the same time. When split is selected, the upper left-hand corner shows the top or bottom view. It's like looking down on your 3D printer's print table. In the lower left section is the front or back view. It's like looking from the front or back of your 3D printer. In the lower right section is the right or left view. It's like looking from the right or left of your 3D printer. In the upper right section is the very important 3D view. In this view, you can zoom and rotate your work freely to see the object from all directions and perspectives. Along the bottom of the interface are several control groups. The first group contains important buttons that allow us to bring up a file dialog, save, undo, redo, or delete. The view area can be split as it is now or show a single view. The view selection buttons help us to select between split, top or bottom, front or back, right or left, and 3D views. Clicking a button twice toggles the view. The next panel shows us valuable information as we draw. We'll call it the information panel. To the right of the information panel is a block of buttons that allow us to toggle grid snap, straight snap, and object snap on and off to aid us in drawing precisely. Moving to the right, we see the options block containing options, help, and browser buttons. Moment of Inspiration's object creation tool set is divided into three pads presenting objects or nouns and actions or verbs. Toolpad 1 contains objects, or nouns like 2D circles, rectangles, and lines. Toolpad 2 contains actions or verbs like join or separate. Toolpad 3 contains the most important verbs, so we've written verbs a little bit bigger. This is where you find frequently used action verbs to extrude your noun or revolve your noun. Clicking on the browser button at the bottom reveals or hides the object browser. Now let's review. We have a top or bottom view. We have a front or back view. We have a right or left view. And we have the 3D view in which we can fully examine our finished drawing from different perspectives. The rightmost top area is reserved for special tool options dialogs that pop up as nouns or verbs are selected from toolpads 1, 2, or 3. This is the end of our overview.